Okay, so um, it's very exciting uh, time right now with MAF 2013. We have a release coming out uh, the first part of October. But let's step back into what we did with 2009, and then we'll move kind of forward here. Um, what you really saw with 2009 was what I call kind of our midpoint release of um, going to the Microsoft stack. So for those of you that are existing customers, you're familiar with the classic client and the uh, older uh, client environment. What we added in NAV 2009 was a new client called um, Roll Taylor Client. And that was really a .NET, really all Microsoft technology on the front end of that uh, client and leveraging Microsoft, Microsoft technology such as web services. And we had uh, business data visualizations. Uh, you know, you saw integration into CRM and a lot of the kind of Windows user interface going forward. Um, with NAF 2013, um, what we're looking at now is what I consider to be the first release of true Microsoft NAV with the entire stack. And, and what I mean is we're, uh, we're going to be re removing or eliminating that classic client layer that we had in the old system and delivering to you what we call a, a role tailor client or the new role tailor client is called a Windows client. And um, by doing that, it's going to allow us to optimize all our entire NAV product on the Microsoft technology. So when you look at reporting, uh, that's been massively improved with NAV 2013. Or if you look at uh, SQL performance or our database performance, uh, it's been greatly enhanced. And the reason for that is it's really now being developed to be optimized and to leverage the entire Microsoft technology stack moving forward. Um, we're leveraging SharePoint clients. So you know, how, does your, how do the managers and the non-power users of the accounting system and the business system here get access to data so that they can see the health of the business at a moment's notice. And so that would be a SharePoint client. And then we look at you know, really extending the application functionality, enhancing our BI. So, so Mike will show you a little bit on the new reporting BI going forward. And the entire application now is, is really in the .NET runtime. And so that's really leveraging uh, once again, the, the entire Microsoft stack. Um, as NAV8 is, is going forward, so what you'll notice is we're going to go into one-year release cycles. That's something that's, that we're changing with, um, with NAV8, and that will be released sometime in 2013. And what we're going to be doing is really being a little bit more laser-focused on uh, very specific functionality and delivering very specific functionality with each release. In 2009, for example, that product was released in, in 2010. Well, we had a midpoint release, or it was originally, sorry, originally a released in 2009, so we had a midpoint release called R2. We're kind of removing that R2, and now what you're just going to see is, is an annual, once again, uh, NAV 2013, it'll be 2014, most probably when NAV 8 comes out. Um, and then moving forward, we're going to continue with the innovation on the um, you know, small, mid-sized business. That's where our focus is for this product. We're going to continue to, to work on improving productivity for your employees, uh, rapid time to value. So how do we deploy the application very efficiently? How is it up, updated very efficiently and, and everything moving forward? So that's really our focus. Um, we're also going to be you know, looking at you know, taking the application and, and hosting it into our Azure development environment as well.